In this example, we will use the automatic morph command to update a mesh to conform to geometry modifications. You can use automatic morph when the modified CAD geometry does not have any topological changes, such as new or deleted vertices, edges, or faces. To begin, in the simulation navigator, right click the part and choose Make Displayed Part. Zoom in on the bottom of the part. Click Move Face to modify the dimensions of the part. Select Faces on the part. Enter a distance of 0.035 and click OK. The part is updated. You should perform mesh morphing immediately after modifying geometry. In the simulation navigator, right click the part and display the FIM again. Close the information window. Zoom in on the bottom of the FIM. Notice that the geometry has changed, but the mesh has not. Now you will morph the mesh to match the updated CAD geometry. Click the Nodes and Elements tab. In the Elements group, click More. And click Automatic Morph. On the Automatic Morph dialog box, click the Display Association tab. Click the bottom face. Then click Show. The nodes associated with the selected face are highlighted. Click Refresh Display to remove the node highlighting. Click the Morph Mesh tab. Select the mesh. And click Show Result. Click Yes to disable FIM update. The mesh is morphed to conform to the geometry. Click OK. Morphing preserves node and element labels. It also retains the size and shape of existing elements in mesh areas that are not affected by changes to geometry. This is different from the FE model update command, which deletes and recreates meshes that are affected by geometry changes. We will now modify another portion of the geometry. In the simulation navigator, right click the CAD part and make it the displayed part. Reposition the part. Click Offset Region. Select Faces. Enter a distance of minus 0.03. And click OK. Display the FIM again. Close the Information window. Click the Nodes and Elements tab. In the Elements group, click More. Click the Automatic Morph command. Click the Display Association tab. Select one of the modified faces. And click Show to display the nodes associated with the face. Click Refresh Display. Then click the Morph Mesh tab. Select the mesh. And click Show Result. The automatic morph command modified the mesh to match the changes to the geometry. You can use automatic morph when the modified CAD geometry does not have any topological changes, such as additions of vertices, edges, or faces.